Good evening, Bunny. How are you doing? You doing okay? That's good to know. What am I doing here? Don't you remember? Today is my day off. And luckily, I managed to sneak away from my family just to see you. You know how my family can be sometimes. They are very... Mm. How do I say it? They're halfwits. You, you are much better than that. I can definitely guarantee. So, I thought tonight you and I could have a very special time. I brought over some wine. I thought that since it's quite late at night, you humans do tend to drink anyway. Am I correct? Good. I know that, because lots of the ruggedy, masculine men that I found in the area do tend to go back home quite late from the bar. About 2 or 3 a.m. But that's okay. They're not us. They don't know what it's like to live with a vampire. I mean, I may have managed to suck their blood on the way here, but that isn't mind. A human is a human. No, not you. You are very different. You are someone who I would never harm. Unless you asked me to, of course. But that's okay. So, I think as of right now that I am in a very protective mood. Yes, indeed. So, I think that because I've fed before I came over here, I've eaten, I think I'm in a very soft kind of mood, despite what my voice leads you to believe. I can see you blushing over there, cutie. I know how my voice makes you feel. So don't worry. I won't lay a finger on you. Well, I will, but not in that way. No harm will come unto you tonight. I'll make sure of it. Trust me. I know exactly how it may feel when vampires are around. No one to turn to, nowhere to go. You don't know if tonight will be your last. Have you not heard on the news? Mysterious deaths lurking around. Witnesses. All hearsay. As far as the public knows, we don't exist. Apart from you. You have no evidence, so I am perfectly fine with having this relationship between us, wouldn't you say? I know you wouldn't betray me, and if you did, they wouldn't believe you. So I am very comfortable right now. Hmm. You're okay. It's fine. It's not like I'm going to sink my teeth into that juicy neck of yours. Oh no. It's my day off. Which means no feeding on you. No work with my family. But that does mean I need to go when the sun comes up. I'm sure you'd understand though, cutie. That I cannot stay here for long. I never have and never will be. But that is how it must be. You know it is. No. Do you mind if I kiss those lips of yours? I've been dying to do that ever since I walked in through that window. Oh, you know what I mean. Do you mind if I kiss you, puppy? 
or not. Hmm, good boy. Come here. I see that fear in your eye. Don't worry, I won't hurt you. My fangs are not out. I only want intimacy. Just because I am around doesn't mean I won't feed on you. Okay? I'm not always that hungry. As much as you lead to believe that. You'll be fine. I guarantee it. See? That wasn't so hard, was it? I didn't think so. Now, puppy. I think I should sit down next to you and want to... Uh, how you're getting on? Is it just me, or is this room a lot tidier ever since I last saw it? You did clean. Good boy. I think it's very nice. You showing that you have care over the place where you sleep is very attractive to me. Because it means that you care about people coming over to your house. For me, I wouldn't particularly comment on it, because normally the rooms that I enter, I take what I want and I leave. I would take you if I could, but I wouldn't do that to you. So I pay close attention to what I'm around. And this room looks much better. I must admit. <laughs> but that's not the only thing that I've noticed when I walked in. Mm. Your body feels different to what I used to feel. Mm. Do I feel some improvement? Absolutely. Mm. This feeling definition. It's improved. Have you done something? Oh yes, I could tell. Don't you know when it comes to the people I care most about, I know every little detail. Well, of course I do, especially to you. So don't worry about it. Everything feels great under my touch. So how about it, puppy? I just want to break open some wine and lay into you. Maybe cuddle on the bed if that's okay. I wouldn't think of any other place I would rather be right now than right here next to you. It sounds great, doesn't it? Yes, it does. I would rather spend my day off with you more than anyone else in the world. So, what should we do first? I am all for it. 